Welcome. In today's video, I'm gonna answer the question, can Salesforce be used for project management? Well, out of the box, it's not the best option for project management. There are task records, but it doesn't have those features you might be expecting, like templates or overall project statuses. But you've got three directions you can potentially go in to fill in those gaps and use it for project management. The first option is to build something yourself within Salesforce. It's a flexible platform. You can create your own records and automations. So you could create the solution that you need. The second option is to buy something or find something for free that's already built on the platform. It's a native project management tool. And then the third option is to integrate with a third party tool. And there's all sorts of very popular, well-known project management tools that integrate directly with Salesforce and share some of that data. So let's talk about the first option, building it yourself. Now you have to decide if it's worth all that effort to build it versus buying it. And what I would say is if we're looking for something that's a simple solution, then building it can actually be a great direction. If you're looking for a lot of advanced features and Gantt charts and visualizations, then I wouldn't really recommend building it yourself. You're probably gonna get better ROI by just paying for a few seats of a solution that's already been built. If you're interested in, in building something yourself, take a look at this other video that we already made that shows you how to build out a project management app step-by-step. Okay, let's look at the second option. You could buy something or use something for free that's pre-built on the Salesforce platform. The benefit of this is that you could take advantage of some of the other platform tools you're familiar with to extend that functionality. For example, if you've got a tool that's been built for you with custom objects and custom code within Salesforce, you can probably still use the built-in reporting and dashboarding engine. You can probably still use Flow to extend it and to update other records within your system as projects move along. And that could be really, really useful. So to find some of these solutions, I recommend going to the App Exchange and just searching for project management here. And there's a few that jump out automatically that I'm a little bit familiar with. Taskray is one that's got advanced features that's built on the Salesforce platform. This project management tool from Salesforce Labs is free and worth checking out. And there's also Cloud Coach that has some advanced functionality when it comes to projects as well. Now these solutions aren't necessarily gonna be free, but if they're built on the platform, they're already integrated into some of the other tools that you're using and worth considering. And then the third option is to integrate with a third party project management tool. So something that's not built within Salesforce's ecosystem, but integrates with Salesforce and shares data. The big limitation here is that only some of that data is gonna be passed back and forth, and you might not be able to take advantage of some of those other platform tools. If you wanna find some of these options, just Google Project Management Salesforce Integration. You'll see a bunch of them pop up right at the top. Some you might recognize like Asana and ClickUp. If you look at the Asana integration here, this one's pretty good. But still, it's Asana's system that is managing all of the tasks and how they're related to each other when it comes to dependencies and what's assigned to who and all of that. You can still, however, trigger projects to be created from Salesforce through Flow and based off other record updates. When an opportunity is closed, for example, you might want that to trigger the creation of a project within Asana. This can also be a great choice for companies that don't have everyone they need in Salesforce. If you don't have licenses for everybody, you might find it more cost effective to get a third party project management tool and then use the integration there. It's just gonna depend on how much data you really need within Salesforce. Notion is another good option for this. There isn't an integration from Notion for Salesforce, but you can use Zapier to connect Salesforce and Notion together. And that might be useful as well if you want extra flexibility around your project management tool. So yes, you can manage projects within Salesforce. You can either build it yourself if it's a simple solution, and we've got a video on that. You can purchase or use a free pre-built solution for you that might have some limitations, but is also gonna be able to take advantage of Salesforce flow and reporting and that sort of thing. Or you can use a third-party tool that's dedicated to project management that integrates with Salesforce through the API. Hope this video was helpful. I'll see you in the next one.